bat be a bat whilst at the same time not be a bat? No, he's either a bat or he's not a bat And he can't transform at the drop of a hat And if I voice a doubt, nor is it batophobic to point this out I'm somewhat perplexed that I even have to say this Nevertheless, it's an act Listen, that man is not a bat He is a man dressed as a bat Likewise, man cannot magically become a woman Even if he seeks a life beyond one Cannot negate biology with a wave of the magic Be a sign of one The transgender woman has no womb, no ovaries XY chromosomes encode the genes She does not have periods regularly Plus will never experience pregnancy Has no acquaintance with menstruation Required a facelift to make him look like her Will never have to endure childbirth And has only a surgically carved makeshift vagina Biologically, it's a falsehood Thus it seems to me they're bluffing Psychologically a man does not know what it means to be a woman Perhaps I misunderstood Nonetheless, I reckon this claptrap hasn't done him good The man who self-identifies as a woman has but a man's grasp upon womanhood That is to say, next to nothing And yet he's sworn he's not gay Perhaps it's an extravagant act of mimicry An extreme form of cosplay With that being said, if a man wishes to live his life imitating a woman or a bat If a man's in a muddle and he's struggling his act Finds himself puzzled and befuddled and detached If a man's having trouble and he's struggling with that. And when it's all said and done, he doesn't have a stomach for the fact Thinks that the remedy would be to proclaim himself as a woman or a bat Fine, but if that man then demands in law that I'm to recognize him as a woman or a bat When he's blatantly neither a woman or a bat, then what type of logic is that? If it's now been declared a diabolical act to plainly state what is a biological fact What then? The have a lack of any proof People, what happened to the truth? Boys will be girls and girls will be boys what? Coming soon to a school near you. This is the new normal. Boys will be girls, and girls will be boys. Gender's a social construct. These folks have lost touch. Hey, so how many goddamn genders are there? And who dreamt up this empty drama? They plumbed the depths and spun this web, and now biology is under threat. Heard to see if the gender theory heard. Gender's a spectrum, haven't you heard? The concept of gender is fluid. Reality check. You are deluded. But now these pitiful little fools wish to teach this piffle to kids in school. Madness in the individual is rare. But amongst herds, it is the rule. When 50% of millennials think gender's a spectrum, I pity the next generation. Condemned to be raised by a bunch of eunuchs who slept through sex education. But there's a difference between sex and gender. When will you dimwits learn? Up until 1955, gender was naught but a linguistic term. But our findings reveal the traditional male and female binary is false. Plus we've discovered the socially constructed nature of gender is entirely a fault. They talk of findings and discoveries. These findings Findings have been trending, but these people can't tell the difference between finding and inventing. And so they broke with reality, enter the age of social insanity. I for one won't be stroking their vanity. Now I'm told this is blasphemy, cause boys will be girls, and girls will be boys. What? Coming soon to a school near you. This is the new normal. Boys will be girls, and girls will be boys. Gender's a social construct. These folks have lost touch on